witches real quick because my kid's taking a nap um as you may know if you follow me on twitter or instagram i'm back it's been a hot minute and i needed it i didn't mean to take the hiatus i actually if you want to be honest i about quit i about quit completely with start witching i was feeling very overwhelmed with what i should be doing or what i was supposed to be doing and man i was feeling the pressure really bad and i wasn't really talking to anybody about it um because when you're in a spiritual business And I see this all the time with other people who are in spiritual businesses and if they do something wrong or they do something, I guess how people don't like them doing it, um, it reflects on them, on their spirituality, on their morals and ethics and all that fun jazz. And... I didn't really want that for myself. I was getting really kind of scared about it. Because I guess I was reaching a level of success with Start Witching that I had not reached before in any other um, personal small business I had ever been part of. And when you get that much exposure, when you get this many people who are interested in what you have to offer and are reading your writing and taking your courses and all that fun stuff, it gets a little scary. Um, so, and I didn't see, I, this is not like a, the thought process I was having two months ago or three months ago at all. Um, I was just feeling overwhelmed and decided to take a step back. I thought it would be a week or so. And then that week or so turned into a month. And then I was like, well, you know what? I'm just going to quit. And I almost did. I almost deleted start witching completely. I was just so like, I guess scared, and rather than talk to anybody about it or process it properly, I took a really big step back, and I was just like, you know what, I'm just going to leave it as it is, and I told a few people I was quitting, I even took up a side hustle a little bit, which I made a little bit of money on, and was like, you know what, I'll just do this, and so be it. And my husband, who is always kind of the person who talks me through things and helps me process stuff, he's actually a really good guide and teacher and coach, um, which is really funny because he would never consider himself that. Um, he's been back and forth on even going to school with his spirituality stuff, but um, he has a hard time seeing himself in that role. But he actually is a really good guide for me. Um, <laughs> when he's not getting, of course, on my nerves, uh, just as a spouse does. But um, we were talking, and I was like, I just, I'm, I just want to have fun. I'm tired of worrying about what I should be doing as far as my business. It's become not fun anymore. Um, because I'm always worrying about what the next step. What, what's the next thing I'm supposed to be doing? because it's a business and I told him really late one night we were up chatting about my situation and I was like I just want to write about the stuff I want to write about and have fun with it I haven't he pointed out that part some of the stuff I've been doing since I took, took a step back was crafting I started doing my paper crafts again I started doing my pen pal um, relationships and swaps again and I was having so much fun with that. And I was like, I miss doing this. And he said, well, you've not done it in forever. Um, all you've been doing, or all I've been doing, is raising my kid and working. That's it. I actually became, and I even kind of just now admitted this to myself, I'm a kind of a workaholic. Um, if I'm not working, I feel like I'm failing. <gasps> Somebody woke up. Hi, sugars. Is that hi? Somebody woke up from their nap. So, 
all that to say, I'm back, and there, you're going to see some changes with Start Witching. I'm going to be doing some stuff that's more fun. It's fun for me. You're not going to see as many courses. You're not going to see as many books. Um, not because those things aren't important, and not because, obviously, many of you really appreciated those and really enjoyed them, but because the pressure was really on me, and I felt like I wasn't doing what I was supposed what I love doing. And so you're going to see more writing. Um, I have two major things I want to do with Star Witching. And that's it. And I'll, I'll post more about that coming soon. Hey, sugars. Oh, sugars. So, things will be slower. Slower, softer. I'm going to be more gentle with myself. And you'll probably see that reflected in my work. So thank you all for watching. I'm sending you so much magical love. Thank you to those of you who messaged me over this time period, asked me how I was doing, checked in on me, told me you missed me. I miss you all too. I really do. Uh, you all are not the reason why I stepped back at all. Um, it was just personal. It was fear. A lot of fear coming up. So I'm going to go chase this kid down and give him lunch. Mwah. I hope you all have a magical day, and I look forward to seeing you again soon.